And now you will enjoy this. Okay, so this is a doctor in Egypt. And there's a mother, and she is terrified. Doc, my kid is turning yellow, and his urine is dark. So the smart doctor asks, What did you eat, my dear son? Nothing, uh, just two bean pitas and five falafel sandwiches. This is a typical Egyptian dude. Okay, now we have something called favism. Favism is another name for G6PD deficiency. Why favism related to falafel? Falafel and fafism have the same Latin root. So in Egypt, we eat bean, which we call fool, and we eat falafel. So fool and falafel, favism, of course, we are doomed in Egypt. So the doctor will take this nice falafel sandwich from the kid and say, stop eating these beans and falafels and you'll be fine, my little boy. And now the mother is happy and everyone is fine. Okay, proud Egyptian. Pay attention, this kid is yellow because of jaundice. The urine is dark because of jaundice. And the bilirubin in the urine. So in the last video, I've explained this process. G6PD is a hero. Why? Because it produces a very nice sun called NADPH. NADPH has three purposes in your life. One, to protect you against the free radical damage so the red blood cells can be spared from this damage. Number two, to protect you against the methemoglobinemia by converting the methemoglobin back to hemoglobin, thus protecting you from the oxidative agents or stressors, in this case, falafel. Third, to convert the oxygen into a superoxide in your neutrophils so that you, they can fight infections. So nice. If there is no G6PD, there is no NADPH, and the oxidative agents such as falafel,